guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Andrea and I post videos twice a week, Monday and Wednesday, about fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. And today we are filming an Ulta haul. I have a bunch of stuff from product lines that I've never tried before, so I'm really, really excited to share it with you. Um, I haven't even opened the boxes and like smelled, tested, nothing. So this is absolutely like first impressions. I won't be using it right now, but I'll definitely always do a follow-up video on hauls, especially when they are product hauls because of course, like, I personally like seeing the reviews about, like, okay, did you like it? Was it worth the money? Like, should I go and get it? Did it work well? Things like that. So, um, I'll be going through this bag, showing you guys what I got, and then definitely I'll get back with you guys with another video letting you know my thoughts about these products. The Ordinary. How many of you guys have, like, looked at The Ordinary products and, like, looked at the price and was like, wait. This has to be a mistake. Like, when I first saw this brand, it was in Sephora, and I looked at it online, and I was like, wait, some sort of oil, $8 at Sephora? Like, this is a joke? Is it bad? Why is it so cheap? The Ordinary, let me read off, like, a description of their brand. Okay, so the brand is vegan, cruelty-free, formulated without oil, alcohol, silicone, nuts, gluten, and fragrance. I want to like read about what's it about. Okay, so I found it. Okay, the ordinary exists to communicate with integrity and bring to market effective, more familiar technologies at honorable prices. The ordinary takes pride in honesty, flight innovation, stagnancy in industry, and indirectly celebrity. Okay, so basically it wants to deliver really great products at really great prices and I love that because I am a person that really, really likes to invest in my skincare. Um, one, because sometimes investing is the only, or the only way to get like really, really great products for your money and two, because it's your skin, you it's like an organ, you have to take care of it and it's not like you can get new skin if you like don't take care of it when you're younger, you know? If you guys watched this video, um, I definitely talk about the differences in prices and how the quality kind of compares with that as well. So finding out like a skincare line that does really, really want to deliver great quality products for that type of price, like that's amazing. So the first one I got is a natural moisturizing factors plus HA uh, it's 3.3 ounces yeah so basically it's a moisturizer for it and also I purchase all these products with that coupon code that's like purchase 40 and get $10 off so that even made it a better deal wow this is actually a great like size for a moisturizer and I love when it's like squeezy tubes like I'm not putting my finger into the tube and creating more like bacteria and germs um, and I like the packaging I really like the color like it's this very satin gray so let's test it out oh is there like oh, okay there's a security seal thing on it which I love you know I hate buying stuff at the drugstore and not seeing any protective seal on it it makes me kind of scared <laughs> okay so so let's test it out. Okay, it has no scent to it, which is nice. It's very white. Hmm. It has a weird smell. It's not overpowering. It just has a weird scent, but it's very, very light. Okay, so you do have to work it into your skin. It's very thick, but then it's also kind of tacky as well. The scent is very, very light. I can't put my finger on it, what it smells like, but it smells almost like a flower, like leaves. Like if you were to like walk in the forest and there's just like a bunch of leaves and it's rained already, like. It smells kind of like that, but it's not overpowering at all. Interesting. 
Let me see. I want to see how, like, I'm going to put a tiny bit. All right. So, a tiny bit. I'm going to work it in. Okay, so it's not that hard to work in. I probably just put a lot on the first try. So, I'm going to test this out because um, my belief moisture bomb that moisturizer is like absolutely my favorite I've been on the hunt for a great moisturizer and that is it so I'll also link that down below or you guys like this video if you want to watch my uh, morning or nighttime routine and all the products that I use because I do use really great products that have worked for my skin that I've like been on the hunt for and the belief moisture bomb check it out if you have dry skin I love it and next this is a huge bottle like compared to the other one but basically this is the glycolic acid toning solution um like I said I've never tried anything from the origins and yeah oh it comes with a pump wait oh or a little squirty thing okay so this is a plastic bottle it is eight ounces and basically it's a toner and you want to use toners because after you wash your face you want to go in with a cotton pad with a toner to kind of take away the stuff that your cleanser missed so like going deep into your pores getting that like excess makeup dirt oil things like that and then after that you can go in with your serums or just moisturizer but it really just leaves your skin very very clean making sure you left nothing behind and from the same video i mentioned before i really want to be on a hunt for an excellent toner um i've only been using thiers and chanel so far and um go watch that video to find out which one's my favorite but yeah i want to find out what other toners I can get. The Chanel is a little bit drying and I do have dry skin so in the winter it's not my favorite to use so I want to find something that works really 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 well for my skin and yeah I got this so let's see what the product page says. Okay so the benefits of this product is to exfoliate skin, refine skin texture, improve skin radiance, um, and it's formulated without alcohol, oil, silicone, nuts, gluten. Um, and you basically use it at night. Um, across your face and neck. Avoid eye area. And yeah, it got a really good rating. It almost got five stars on the Ulta website. So that's what drew me to it. And it was under $10. Like, what? It is $8.70 for this product. So, yeah, I really want to try it out. But I don't think... This little thing has like, oh, it does, it does. <laughs> so I was thinking that, oh, okay. So the top is like the kind that you twist open and then twist close. So let me open this and then I'm putting this new top on there. It doesn't smell like anything. You know like the scent of tea where it's like before all the added sugar and honey? It smells like that. What should I spray it on? Do I have anything to spray it on? Oh, I just washed my makeup brushes with this towel and I set it to dry. So I'm just going to squirt a little bit on there just so I can, like, smell. <laughs> so. Oh, and it's very, like, it just drops. So it doesn't squirt. So I guess that's good if you don't want to, like, overuse a product. Yeah, it doesn't really smell like anything, which is great. Yeah, and so what you do, you just put it on a cotton pad. And then you just rub it on your skin and kind of it exfoliates. It's supposed to get extra gunk out. So I'm excited to try this out. Yeah, I'll let you guys know my thoughts on this and give you a review once I use it for like a couple weeks. But I'm excited to try this out. For the price, you really cannot beat this. Okay, guys. Two more products. Um, do you remember when everyone was talking about this? And I mean like everybody. The e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer because I went to Sephora because everyone was saying that this was a dupe for the Tatcha Primer and the Tatcha Primer is like super expensive but I tested it out on my skin just the tiniest bit and I was like it just literally transformed the palm of or the back of my hand 
but for that price i was just like eh. so okay if i can get this little thing out then maybe i can talk about it so this is supposedly the dupe for the tatcha primer and it comes in like a tub where you dip your finger in it as well which is not my favorite thing but whatever it is what it is it doesn't smell like anything i'm gonna dip my finger in it oh it's almost like a cream so let me put it on the back of my hand i don't know wait let me put it i put lotion on that hand let me try it on this hand okay it does feel very very moisturizing like it gave a good soothing look to the skin so i'm very excited to try this out let's see it's very sheer it leaves no type of like color residue um i want to try this out actually guys stay in tune one of my videos i'm gonna be um testing out this versus the smashbox primer and seeing which one it works best which one's better which would be like a luxury versus drugstore review. I love doing those kind. And last but not least is this L'Oreal Paris quick and easy waterproof all day liquid liner. Um, on the website, I was looking for a drugstore primer that also um, had really, really good ratings and this was one of them. So let me open it up here. It has like this weird triangle, which I think it's to help you do the wing. I've never seen that before. Weird. Do you see that? It's like, do I take this off? Oh, I can't. Oh, wait. Oh, crap. So it is like, it's like this flexible little piece of plastic. So there goes a the wing. So I guess you're supposed to go like that and fill it in. I don't know, but that's a really, I don't know, that's weird. I, I won't be using that. <laughs> Let's test it out. Ooh. It's very, ding. I like it. It's very skinny. I kind of want to test it out right now. Should I, should I do it? Uh, I don't think so. I don't want to. <laughs> I just sounded like a little child, but basically, um, I already put on mascara and I like doing my eyeliner before I do mascara because you know then your lashes are like tough and like stiff so you're not able to move your hand. I don't know. It's a whole thing for me. But um, I will be testing this out. Um, I got a really good review so I'm excited. And it looks from like the swatches it looks very matte and dark and I could do put it wide if I wanted to. So cool. I am so excited. Let me see exactly how many stars it got. So I got four and a half stars, which is really great. It has brown and black. And it used to be $10.99 and now it's down to $8.24. And that was before um the coupon code that I added. Oh, okay, so it says position open part of stencil at the outer edge, lay flat, fill in stencil, remove stencil. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. So I'm sure I can like put it this way and make that like wing super super sharp so okay i'm sorry l'oreal maybe i will use you okay guys and that is it for the video if you guys like it please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you guys want me to test out any products that you guys are thinking about like trying out let me know and i'll definitely purchase and test them out for you guys okay that is it and i'll see you in my next video bye guys